As promised, here is Kevin Crow. He is the agronomist and field operations manager for Subair, and you're going to actually show us how this system works. How does it work? Right. Well, what we've got is the, our system is tied to the drainage system underneath the green, and right now we're actually pulling a vacuum, so as fast as he can put the water on the green, the vacuum from our blower is physically pulling that water down through the soil profile. As you watch it, you notice even as it, as it puddles, that puddle's not growing. And if he stops that hose, that entire puddle will disappear. The water will go through the soil profile, into the drainage pipes, and out of the greens profile. Well, let's turn on the system and find out how long it takes to have the water disappear, be sucked out of the green. Okay. So let's start the clock now and see how long it takes. Okay. That is unbelievable, it's amazing. Kevin. That is unbelievable. It is amazing. I mean, you told me it would probably take about five minutes for it to go out. It literally took probably about a minute for it to go out. That is unbelievable. How, how much rain could fall at Augusta National in one day, and you could have these things back to the speed they were the day before? Well, anytime you put that, you know, a large amount of water in the profile, you're going to soften it some. So what we're doing is we're accelerating the process of getting the water out and refirming the greens. So. Yeah, if they had a two-inch rain, I think we had about an inch and a half to two inches of rain today. They should be back to normal tomorrow. No so, problem. you know, if the greens were rolling, let's say, around 12, you think it would get right back up to 12 by Friday? Absolutely. That is fascinating. The sub-air system is certainly uh, a spectacle at Augusta National and about 250 courses around the world. Thank you for your time, Kevin. We well, really appreciate it. All right, you got it. All right, thanks.